Listen to 2 Corinthians 11 and listen to the trials of Paul. He says, are they servants of Christ? I'm talking like a madman, but I'm a better one. With far more labors, far more imprisonments, far worse beatings, near death many times. Five times I received 39 lashes from the Jews. Three times I was beaten with rods by the Romans. Once I was stoned by my enemies. Three times I was shipwrecked. I spent a night and a day in the open sea. On frequent journeys, I have faced dangers from rivers, robbers, my own people, Gentiles, the city, the open country, the sea among false brothers, from labor, from hardship. I've had many sleepless nights, hunger and thirst. I, listen to this. Often often without food and cold and lacking clothing. Not to mention the other things, there's a daily pressure on me to care for all of the churches. What would your list of struggle with Christ be? Oh, I had to stay a little longer and I didn't really want to go. I mean, he's got this whole thing. And when he says, in my time of departure, he's like, I have been pulling this thing. I've been pulling in the strength of Christ and walking with God. And that's why he says in Philippians chapter one, verse 21, he says, for me to live is Christ and to die is gain. I give you hope for your loved one that is in heaven now, that was a believer in Christ. Maybe they got there earlier than you wanted them to get there, but they are there with Jesus. Jesus has got them. That's why it says in the word, we don't grieve like those who have no hope. We grieve with hope because we know it's like a multi-stage rocket, this section of earth falls away, but as a believer, we continue into the clouds, so to speak, to be with Christ and to be with him for all of eternity. So he says in this looking down, he's looking down, he's saying, I'm going to die. I know I'm going to die and I'm going to be poured out like a drink offering and my time of departure is close. I'm in a prison right now. I'm probably never getting out of here, but let me tell you what, I, my ship is set in sail. My yoke is being laid down. My tent is folding up and I am walking with God to loosen as a prisoner into the freedom of Christ. I'm walking these things out. Hey, thanks for watching. To find out more about Houston's First, you can subscribe to our channel or you can go to houstonsfirst.org.